Do you know who this guy is? Hello. Today we're learning about him. And he lives inside your body. Hey everybody, welcome to Storytime with Jen. My name is Jen, what's your name? Amazing! Today we'll be learning about vaccines. And Henry is here with us today because he's going to get a vaccine. But first, let's make sure you're ready to listen by tickling your ears. Are you ready? Great, let's begin. Vaccines by Cara Florence and John Florence. Inside your body, you have a lot of helpers called an immune system that work together to keep you healthy. Like macrophage, antibody, like that guy we saw earlier, and dendritic cell. An important job of your immune system is to get rid of germs, which are tiny little things that can make you sick germ you just sneezed out, Achoo! flu virus, Ebola virus. Your immune system can recognize different germs because each germ looks different. Like streptococcus pneumonia bacteria has these things sticking out of them and measles morbillivirus got these ones sticking out of them. See how they're different? These differences are called antigens. See, it's like hair around them. Like this Haemophilus influenza type B. And it's got different looking antigens. This is different, this is different, this is different. When your immune system sees a new germ, it makes antibodies that match that germ's antigen. See the antigen on the bad germ? There's a square and a triangle. And check this out. This antibody has a square and a triangle too. So they match. Antibodies can fit around the germ's antigen perfectly like a magnetic puzzle piece or like a glove. Once the antibody sticks to the antigen, your immune system can get rid of that germ. Yes! Gotcha! Gotcha, germ! Thanks! Now I'll get him out of here! Remember the macrophage? He's gonna kick up the germs. Sometimes you still get sick the first time you get a germ, but if you get that germ again, you will have antibodies ready and your body will act faster and stronger. So you might not even feel sick the second time. Did you just lick a shoe? They licked the shoe again. Look. Please don't lick your shoes. It's gross. That's my antigen, I got it. See how it's got a square and a hexagon? And these germs have a square and a hexagon? This antibody is gonna match with this one and then the macrophage is gonna come and kick out those germs, oh yeah. But there are some germs that are so bad 
that you don't want to be sick with them ever. Oh, look at these really, really bad germs. They're super dangerous. Oh. Luckily, we have vaccines. Vaccines help your immune system stop those bad germs from getting you sick. Sometimes you get vaccines when you go to the doctor's office. Have you seen this before? Yes. We've got the syringe and the needle. And inside is the medicine we call vaccine. Vaccines show your immune system what really bad germs look like so your body can make antibodies without getting sick from that germ. To make vaccines, scientists may use antigen pieces from these really bad germs. This one. Big bad germs don't scare me. Oh no! Or scientists can make versions of the germs that can't get you sick but still look the same. Like these antigen looks like these antigen, but this one's a bad germ and this is a good germ. Your body makes antibodies to the vaccine antigens just like it would if you got sick with a real germ. Twinsies! Then if your body sees that germ later, it will get rid of it before it makes you sick. Awesome! It's most important that most people get vaccinated so bad germs won't spread so easily. Oh, see? All these babies are sick. How many babies are sick? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is called herd immunity and helps protect people who can't get vaccines, like newborns. See, now that most people here got vaccinated, there's only one two babies that are sick. Vaccines have saved people's lives. Thank you, vaccines. Thanks for keeping us all safe. You're the best. Maybe you can help make the vaccines of the future. <gasps> awesome. Now it's time for Henry to get his vaccine. First, we'll get our alcohol pad to clean the area. Then we'll get our handy dandy vaccine. Okay, Henry, be brave, hold tight. All done. And then we'll seal it all up with a Band-Aid. Thanks for hanging out with us today. Don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you later.